Hey, how's it going guys? Mr. Boss for the win here. And in today's GTA video, I'm going to be talking to you guys about where the hell all these GTA 6 rumors are coming from. That's right. I don't know about you guys, but really over the past six months, I have just seen a massive surge in whether it be websites or videos talking about Grand Theft Auto 6. And I'm just kind of sitting here like, wait a minute, there's been absolutely like a fraction of 1% of GTA 6 information that's been confirmed. The only thing that's really come out and nothing's even been said about the name GTA 6 is that Rockstar would like to keep making Grand Theft Auto games, which should have been pretty obvious from the fact that Grand Theft Auto 5 made a billion dollars in like 24 hours or something like that. It was totally ridiculous. And even the Take-Two CEO, Strauss Zelnick, said that Grand Theft Auto is something that is going to be a permanent franchise. That's pretty much the only bits of confirmed information about the next Grand Theft Auto game. But as I've mentioned recently, there have been a ton of videos and a ton of articles that have been produced on Grand Theft Auto 6 and GTA 6 gameplay and the characters and the setting and the trailer and when it's coming out. And it's just been madness. And I'm going to be talking about why I think these are all starting to come up. So for example, let's just do a quick Google search of GTA 6. And you can see that we got almost 14 million results in half a second. And some of the news articles, as you can see right here, GTA 6 release date, news, rumors, maps, and characters. Is GTA 6 even happening? GTA 6 release date, GTA Online, may fast track Grand Theft Auto 6 development, may release between 2018 and 2020. Another one is GTA 6 will most likely be released between 2018 and 2020. And to be fair, there are some okay Grand Theft Auto 6 articles. For example, this one by Gazette Review. They say GTA 6 wish list, things gamers would like to see. That's totally cool. If you want to talk about what you'd personally like to see in the next Grand Theft Auto 6 games, thumbs up for you. That's awesome and that's really cool. It's great to kind of think ahead in the future. Also, from the mirror.co.uk, uh, GTA 6 rumors, Rockstar's already started on its next dot, dot, dot. Um, I think they're talking about secret projects. You know, that's rumors. Rumors are totally okay. But then, as I mentioned, there's some crazy ones like GTA 6 release date news, GTA 6 production underway. And while some of that might actually be true, like the production of Grand Theft Auto 6, I'm almost positive that just a few short months after the release of Grand Theft Auto 5 that Rockstar was sitting down and saying, okay, let's get to work on the next one. This one was so groundbreaking and so big that we've got to already start pushing it out. But I'm just curious and I want to hear from you guys in the comments section, where do you think all of this is coming from? Because, I, and this might not be because I was so tuned into the GTA community, but I feel like when Grand Theft Auto 4 was a year or two out, we weren't having all these like crazy news articles right about the next Grand Theft Auto game. And I think this is occurring for two reasons, especially within the past month or so. The first of which is that Take-Two Interactive has confirmed that there's going to be some big things coming out at E3, the Electronic Entertainment Expo. And while we don't 100% know for a fact that Rockstar is going to be there, because Rockstar falls under this Take-Two umbrella, it seems that everyone and their mom are under the impression that something new is going to be announced from Rockstar. And because Grand Theft Auto is Rockstar's biggest game and its biggest franchise, I guess naturally people are assuming that something at this massive video game convention is going to be released. And a lot of these websites are running with the GTA 6 or the next Grand Theft Auto game as the like titles of their articles and whatnot. And number two, I think these rumors are also coming about because they probably generate a lot of traffic. Now, I can't speak for the websites that are writing these reviews because it's kind of hard to see, you know, how well an article is doing. But I certainly see some GTA 6 videos on YouTube that claim to either be talking about something and it's really just, you know, rumors and information that have a lot of views. And like I said, I don't blame people for doing that. If that's what you want to do, you go for it. But there just doesn't seem to be a lot of substance yet regarding Grand Theft Auto 6 or whatever the next GTA game is going to be. And that really brings me to my final point today. And that just is you need to be careful when you're reading articles like this, because as I've stated in this video, most of it is just rumors, opinions, wish list. I think 0.00001% of things that are written or things that are said in videos are actually confirmed to be happening. So please do take everything with a grain of salt. And you should also realize this by some of the website titles that are writing these posts. 
For example, the top post for GTA 6 right now is by Christian Daily, which is a Christian website and magazine. So once again, I don't really know what exactly they're doing writing an article like this, um, but that seems kind of interesting. Another one is Christian Today. The other one is Counsel and Heal. Another website is Parent Herald, which website slogan is actually Parenting, Education, and Family Lifestyle News. Not exactly sure where Grand Theft Auto 6 fits into this, but nonetheless, these are the types of websites that are writing articles because it kind of, I guess, seems like stuff like this is getting news and is getting views. So even websites that aren't geared towards gaming are picking up on this, and most of the information is false or just regurgitated information from another gaming website pulling rumors from another anonymous source. So at the end of the day, just be careful about what you read. You won't be like physically harmed by reading these articles, but if you go into them and these videos and whatnot expecting to learn factual information about Grand Theft Auto 6 news, you're gonna come out disappointed because as I've mentioned, about 00001% of all GTA 6 information has been confirmed. The rest is rumors. The rest is things that have been leaked by anonymous sources, and none of it has a lot of backing. And honestly, in my opinion, I don't even think the next Rockstar game is going to be Grand Theft Auto 6. I think it's going to be a game like Red Dead Redemption or Bully or maybe in the Max Payne series. Who knows? But I think Rockstar is going to have a game in between the next installment of the Grand Theft Auto franchise. So as always, I'd love to hear from you guys in the comments section down below. Let me know what you think about all this GTA 6 madness, the news articles, videos, and websites that are publishing all this stuff. Just let me know what you guys think in the comments section down below. If you did go on to enjoy the video, like rating would of course be awesome. And also subscribe to my YouTube channel if you are new or you like daily GTA 5 videos like this. Without the way, guys, like I said, thanks for watching. Take care, and I'll see you guys in the next video.